the squad i know your girl monique looks toe back but you know what this is my last minute packing video so um just gonna have to deal with me when i wear no makeup okay um it is the weekend and i'm going to be finishing my packing if you guys have not seen my hygiene travel bag pack video i will link it down in the section below but welcome back diva squad or if you're new what's up my name is monique nicole aka diva on a budget i typically do beauty curvy fashion travel diys and so much more so if any of that interests you go ahead smash the subscribe join my diva squad also hit that notification bell click always so you'll never miss when i drop a new upload sorry about my ring light with my glasses but um i don't have contacts on right now and your girl can't see so please bear with me but i'm gonna go ahead and get on into this um travel packing vlog and the essentials that you need when you do go for me okay also guys look at my nails i just got them done beautiful chrome i got these two in a french tip with the bling by the cuticle and i just love this beautiful chrome purple just gorgeous she always does my natural nails so beautiful this is a gel set so of course as you could tell my pinky nail broke right here but this is all natural all mine no acrylic and yeah i really don't like doing acrylic because um it messes your natural nail up when you can just really do gel and it looks so much better so yeah I did get this mini cup, this eight ounce cup that comes with two different straws, two different lids, and actually you don't have to, <clears throat> it's stuck on there. You don't have to have this little carrying thing. Oh. You can actually just hold it like this, but I love this because of course it kind of gives a mug thing and it's a little bit more convenient for me. But I got this for $10.99 on Amazon and it's called DJ PK PK Cup. But I got this because it keeps my warm drinks warm for hours or my cold drinks cold for hours and also compact. And I love metal straws. Um, the glass straws I can't do because I have a lot of kids that I, you know, nanny or come over. I have family that come over and plus I'm clumsy. I can't do the glass straws. I don't like plastic straws because, you know, save the planet. You know what I'm saying? So I do my metal straws. And I wash them and I keep them, you know, in my drawer. So you could use this different ways. You can use it like from the sippy cup part or throw the straw in. This closes so you can use the sippy cup part. But I love this. It was $10.99 from Amazon. So let's go ahead and start packing. Okay, also, if you guys haven't seen my travel hygiene pack video yet, I'm going to finish that video because i did have some things that i was missing from there and i did order some things from ulta but check this out small story time this is a rant but i do have a reason for it your girl went and ordered that um boar bristle brush that i wanted from that video and a mini a translucent powder from ulta I spent 30 bucks on this stuff okay 30 bucks right why did the ulta worker go and throw it on my on top of my mailbox and someone stole my stuff so now i'm out items and i'm out money it's real people out there all of you guys god gonna get you god don't like ugly okay and if your name is not on the package do not i repeat do not put your hands on somebody else's package and steal them karma is you know what karma will come and get y'all I'm just saying, I'm praying for y'all. Anyways, let's get on into this video because now I'm a little, you know, chatty now, right now. As you guys saw, all the stuff that I told you that I had put in in the last video, the only thing that I had added to it was this um, micellar cleansing water, and it's with vitamin C, removes makeup, and cleanses plus glow. So I got that. So I'm also gonna have to throw some cotton balls in there because I do not, I repeat, I do not like using wipes on my face anymore, the makeup remover wipes, because like I said, save the planet. So that's why I usually, I use these. 
So I use that, but I got that for exfoliating my face. So I'll be bringing some cotton balls. Um, and also, I did get this from Rite Aid. Toothbrush, toothpaste, and mouthwash. And I'm going to go ahead and open this and throw this in there. So I got um, this brush kit and I'm going to be taking this one. I really needed one anyway, so I'm going to be taking this. And you know what? Let me correct myself. My daughter actually bought this stuff for me because my card was acting wonky. You know, I don't know what happened with that, but my daughter. I'm going to give her credit where credit is due. Thank you, Kari. I love you. So, yeah. And then um, I'm going to be bringing my chafing gel because thick thighs save lives and we don't want to create forest fires down there. So... I got my chafing gel, and I also got a headband for when I do my mask, wash on my face, and stuff like that for my baby hairs. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in there. And I also got this Carol's Daughter Black Vanilla Hydrating Leave-In Conditioning Spray. So those are the things that I actually got to add into here. I'm not sure if this brush is going to... Um, if this brush is going to well, that was hard fit in here correctly I hope so yeah I am for sure it's not gonna close so this it's not closing this time because I have too much stuff in it it's not gonna buckle but that's okay I can actually pack it like this and that's what I'm gonna do so well let me go ahead and get my luggage situated so I can pack my luggage um, I also wanted to put that I usually plan out my outfits and here's my little guide I'm gonna scoot over a little bit here's my little guide of planning out my outfits and I usually try to do two outfits a day one day outfit and one night outfit and then um, I didn't put my bathing suits on there but I will let you guys know where I got all my clothes once I show you my little outfits okay so stay tuned let me get my, my luggage so divas this is my luggage and it's small but it's mighty and I love the design on here I always keep a name tag just in case my luggage gets lost and I always put a lock on my luggage also so let's get into this bad boy <sighs> okay this one's going to be a long one, you guys, so if you get all the way to the end of this video, go ahead and throw a little airplane um, in the comment section, and let's have a conversation. Where do you think I'm going? I'll let you know. Maybe on my Instagram, so be following me on my Instagram, leave on the budget right here. Okay, <clears throat> so what I've noticed is that I usually try to put my clothes right here in this side so that it's protected and I, you know, close it up and zipper it up with that. So let's go ahead and try and do that even though this side's a little bit deeper. So I'm not sure if it's all going to fit in that side. But let's start packing my stuff, okay? So as you can see, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to... Um, put up my little clothing chart so you can see um but this one is actually not on the clothing chart because i didn't put my pajamas but this pajama set is on my shein haul my shein valentine haul and it's a cute like satin robe with ruffly arms and ruffly legs <clears throat> so if you like stuff that's cute and fancy like that you'll love this one and it's at an amazing price i love shein but lately shein's been kind of taking on my nerves because um honestly I have a package that I ordered about a month ago, literally about a month ago. It's been three and a half weeks since I've ordered this package and I still have not gotten it. And they're with this new um, company, SpeedX. I believe it's not Shein's fault. I believe it's SpeedX's fault because they tried to um, deliver my stuff and I'm in a gated community, right? So they tried to deliver my stuff and they evidently couldn't get in. So they sent my stuff back to Compton. And it said that I got my stuff on January 20th, 28th, which is now what? It's now February 11th. So um, where's my stuff? So I emailed them and I said, I really would like my stuff because it was for my vacation. But if you're not going to give it to me, give me my money back. You see what I'm saying? And I love Shein because of all the things that you can get for a good amount of money and you know it's a lot of hate you know there's i'm also like perks and there's also like you know cons too when it comes to it but you know she and she is pretty good um but since this new company had they hired on this new company i don't like it i don't like it because she's been really good until this day hired this new delivery company and now they ain't really been on it so she tell your delivery people to get on it okay and i've also read reviews and i'm not the only person that says that so anyways yeah so that's from she <clears throat> this is also from she too and it's satin too and it's light pink and it has lace bottoms instead of the ruffle and it has a little tie and this is a 2x and it has a cute cami it has a cute cami shirt so i'm gonna try to put this on top of this 
And the cami shirt is um, spaghetti strap. Very, very cute, comfy, you know. And um, this is from Shein also. Like I said, I love Shein and they have some good quality things for, on the, for Lolo. And I got these from Shein too. Um, these little slippers that I can walk around the room in um, and be comfy at night and they have soles. And I got these. So I'm gonna go ahead and put those in there. Actually, I'm gonna put those on this side. So I believe that's it for for what I could show you because I have something else that's a little bit more sexy, x rated x rated But I'll put that in there later. But let me go ahead and start putting my shorts in here and I'll show you my guide again. These shorts, these are cute jean shorts I got from Fashion Nova. Really nice, stretchy, comfortable. These shorts I got from Rainbow. These do not have front pockets, but they have back pockets. There's a couple little strings on there, I have to iron them. And they're also um, cut off shorts with drawstring. Very comfortable. Put this in there. I got some jeans from, I believe this is from Walmart or Target. Really nice jeans to stretch my knee. A little bit high on the ankle, but very cute. And I like to kind of roll my stuff up a little bit. These pants I really love. I come from Fashion Nova. Kind of bell bottom pants. Very um, soft and stretchy. Super long for my tall girls like me. Five foot seven and a half. Um, so very, very nice pants. And I got this shirt to go with. This is the pants. Long sleeve crop top shirt. These are my workout shorts. So let me go ahead and put those right here. Um, I got a workout t-shirt. Cute. This is my workout t-shirt. And I got this from Walmart, of course. And y'all, if y'all know about the cami, the little t-shirt cami, this was probably like five bucks. So but I show you my, my guide on my clothes, and I'm showing you what I didn't show you on my on my vlog. So after this, this is my crop top that I got with my jeans that I'm going to be wearing. I got that from Walmart. But I showed you, I showed you my little guide for my clothes that I checked off. I showed you the clothes that I didn't show you in my um, Shein haul. Now I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward this up. So all the other stuff you've already seen from my Shein haul, okay? Tone it down a little bit because I didn't show you guys this. This is my little sarong that I got for my bathing suit that I'm going to be wearing, and I'll show you that in a little bit. And I have another sarong. Very cute, fancy, you know, sarong, because I'm going to be somewhere that's really beautiful, warmer climate, you know. And this sarong, I got from Shein, of course. This sarong, Target. So I'm closing this part with all my clothes, and I got all my clothes in here compacted pretty good. Other than my airport outfit that I'll be wearing there. And I'm kind of, oof. It's a little tight here, but I know I can make it fit. So. so let me show you guys my bathing suit. So I did show this bathing suit in a haul, a small fashion haul in the past on my Instagram. It's probably not on there anymore, but um, this is a this is called the. This is called the Senorita Margarita Rose Two Piece Bikini, and it's tan in a size 1X. You guys can see it. And this is from Fashion Nova. And it is, this is so cute. It has the tie right here. You can, you know, adjust this. You can adjust the back part. And it's actually a long bikini. You can adjust the front part right here, put bows here, and I, you know, booty out. Yes. It's going to be a moment. <laughs> but that's one of my big bikinis that I did get for the trip. And I also got this beautiful green one that I showed on my Shein haul. The textured green one with the middle piece right here um and it's adjustable also and there's a keyhole and then the bottoms are pretty much just simple and plain with the texture also both of these bikinis are high-waisted and i will be putting them in the shein swim bag because <laughs> that's where i got this green bikini so yeah i also had to get one more bathing suit because uh i need three because i'm going to be there for five days and four nights so i got this other shein bikini set and it's high-waisted also it's all white and it has a top that I can, it's a versatile top that I can just tie it however I want to tie it. <clears throat> so hopefully I can fit that in this bag. And then I also brought like a white sarong. I wear this on my Jamaica trip, it's so beautiful. Um, I'll also link that down in the description below if you guys want to take a look at it. So let me see if I can try and fit this in here. This last bikini. I made it work. So I put all my shoes in bags because I don't want my suitcase getting all dirty. But I got these tie up, these pretty tie up pink Kitten heels that I got from Shein. I also got two different kinds of sandals that I got from Timu. And um, one is like multicolored and one is white. This one's got a thicker sole and this one's got a thinner sole. shoe soles that I can put in these shoes because they're a little bit higher but I really do love these and I have not worn them out so 
I got these beautiful new feather heels. Very beautiful. And I will be bringing those also. You know, I just kind of want options, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Last pair of shoes that I'm going to be bringing, but I'm going to be wearing these on my flight or my Nikes, my low, um, my low cut Nikes. I do have some high top ones, Air Force ones, but I don't want to get those dirty and those are already kind of old. So I'm just going to go ahead and put those in there. I'm going to put my purses in. All these purses are from Shein, so just in case you want to know. Have my water shoes. Got these from Amazon. I also have another hat, just in case. Variety. Or if I want to wear this on the beach with my bathing suit. Beach towel. Sunglasses. I don't know why, but I always have to bring some snack and my luggage. Not my carry-on, but my luggage that goes through. I always bring some, a couple of uh, rebels. So I got the blueberry rebel. I got a juneberry rebel, just for my refrigerator, just to make sure. Um, a pair of cinnamon. This one's my favorite. I got two of those, two June berries, and two pear and cinnamons, and then one blueberry. Also got some baked, baked hot Cheetos, because I love hot Cheetos, and then some cherry sours, because this is one of my favorite candies. So I'm going to try try to swing it. I might take this one out and drink it, because I'm kind of, you know, a little sluggish right now, but I'm going to try to make it work. I really want to put some waters in here, too, but I don't know, so... The struggle is real. I am determined. I made it work. Now I gotta go weigh it. Here's the scale. Let's see what it says. What? 26.4? She did that. Okay, you guys, we're going to be moving on to this little bag. I got this from Ipsy. And um, I'm just gonna be using this for like my medical bag. So, slash cleaning bag. So, I got these Lysol wipes on the go so I can clean the room, clean the surfaces because, you know, COVID's still alive. And also this to-go Lysol spray to spray everywhere that I'm going to be touching. Um, the sinks, the counters, the bed, the walls, wherever. I will use that, put that in there. Liquid IV. I know it looks kind of crazy, but, you know, just in case hangover. This is some sunblock. I just wanted to put it in a smaller container. Nasal spray relief. Um, a mini first aid kit. Has ointments. 
It has different ointments in here, burn aid, cream, and stuff like that. Band-aids, some Tums. Um, I also will be putting in my vitamins, fish oil pills and vitamins. Um, these are my everyday pills that I take. Also, I'm going to be putting a couple of this restless leg syndrome stuff also in there too if I can fit it. If not, I'll probably put it in this little Ziploc bag and throw it in there because sometimes my legs jump when I go to sleep and I cannot sleep. So I have to take two of these, put it underneath my tongue, let it melt. And then I could actually rest without taking a bunch of ibuprofen or Tylenol. So I know you guys can see it's kind of messy. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put this stuff in here. Fast forward it and see if I can fit everything in here. I'm actually not going to put these in there because I need to take my vitamins and stuff for tomorrow. So those will be set aside. So that's going to go with my hygiene i also got this i wanted to show you guys this is my travel size brushes blush brush um eyeliner whatever and then i got a couple of these here these little sponges so that i can have some stuff to put my makeup on the go okay you guys moving on to the electronics so of course i got this portable speaker and you can hang it on stuff and it is called hey song bubble speaker and it's waterproof so it floats on top of the water right here like this i can clip it on a bag whatever of course i need this just to bump in my room or wherever i'm at if i want to bump at the pool or whatever of course i got me a little ring light i got a charger for my ring light I got a portable charger. Purple's my favorite color, y'all. So it has a top. It goes like this. You can stick it in your phone like this at the bottom part of your phone. My phone is charging right now. It has a charger also, and it's a C charger, thank God. So I'll be using that um, of my carry-on just in case or when I when I'm out and about so that is so convenient I really love that and then of course I got um, my foam water case and I got this from Jamaica as you can see it says Jamaica on there one love and it all you have to do is slip your phone in here and it works super super good slip your phone in here it's magnetic of course and then these little pieces right here you're going to like once you clip it together you're going to move them and close them like that you can hear that snap so and then it'll keep your phone safe so so i can take pictures in the water and i won't be able to get i won't have i won't get my phone wet so i love that of course i have to bring snacks i have to bring coffee on the go just in case i have some snacks and these are some um, nature valley crunchy dip peanut butter and there's crunchy dip chocolate there's a couple little rice crispy treats in here just for snacking on the go if we're out and about and we're not anywhere where we can buy any food of course i have to do that and i have my cheetos baked cheetos 50 percent less fat and it is it's 140 per serving for the regular bag it's way way higher and then of course i have to bring my cherry flowers and y'all know about my red bulls i put my red bull in my luggage 26 pounds y'all i don't know how i did that but it's neither here nor there but that was amazing so this will be going in my bag this is my travel um, size bag. My everyday one is a bigger one and it has kisses all over it. But this is my travel makeup bag. And I'll tell you guys what's in here. And I might be able to get away with not using this and use this for my electronics instead. But we'll see. I have some lashes. 
and I'll probably be bringing another pair of lashes. I'm not sure what kind of lashes these are, but usually I use Wispies, Kiss Wispies, um, or Ardell Wispies. And these are the Ardell ones. These are the other ones that I that I'm going to be bringing, but I'm going to put it in another little package like that so it's smaller. I have a small white eyeliner. I have some body oil in lavender, a little small body oil in lavender. I have some brow gel from Ulta, Ulta Beauty. I have some tinted juice infused um, lip oil from Ulta Beauty. A blush and highlighter duo from Ulta Beauty. And this all came in like a free little package and I got like something, I believe it was like end of last year, I got something and got a whole free like palette and everything. And let me see, I got Mattifying Face Primer from Ulta Beauty. Let me just take all this stuff out so I can get everything. Matte Eye Primer from Ulta Beauty. And that's it from Ulta Beauty. I also got a Cuvine Black Eyeliner for my waterline. I have a Precise My Brow Pencil from Benefit for my brows. I have a Strip Lash Adhesive with Aloe and Black from Kiss. I probably will not use this. I'm going to switch to the Duo uh, Brush on Adhesive with Vitamins. And this is actually a clear one. The Duo is the clear and the Kiss is black. And that's why I want to go ahead and use the clear one. Because the Kiss one with black is black. And um, I just want to be able to snap my lashes on and not make a mistake. I have Liquid Liner, Tracer, and Blend Mild Issue O Proof. And it's in dark brown, so I have that. I'm also going to be bringing the Maybelline Line Stiletto in black, jet black. Um, I also am going to be bringing my tweezers for my lashes. And I'm also going to be bringing my LA Colors Conceal It Cover and Correct Concealer because my, I have dark spots under my eyes to color correct. And I was trying to get a smaller, um, I was trying to get a smaller mascara, but I couldn't get one. So I have the Lash Sensational Sky High from Maybelline. I'm also going to be bringing my ELF 16 hour camel concealer and it's in cinnamon and this is for bronzing. And I also got a brand new 16 hour camel concealer and it's in the color Sable, I'm sorry, it's in the color medium sand and that's for my other artists. And I'm trying not to wear a lot of makeup and product on my face so I do not want to be wearing a lot of foundation. I'm just gonna probably conceal, bronze and get it over with. Also some Serena Soaps, um, Princess Glitter Lip Gloss. And that's how it looks gorgeous y'all gorgeous and i'm going to be bringing also the huda beauty amethyst obsession palette this palette is stunning you guys look at that yes that's gonna be perfect for valentine's day and the wonder beauty palette and the palette is called getaway and this one is amazing because it has blush and highlighter in it and it has all the new everyday shades that i could wear excuse how it looks and then i also have some la fresh travel light makeup remover wipe this is an old makeup remover wipe i really don't like using makeup remover wipes but it's in there so i'm just gonna have to keep it in there and so I'm going to put all this stuff in here, so I'll fast forward this. Y'all, it barely fit in there. And I still have my Joa Selfie Ready translucent powder that could not fit in there. I was trying to get a smaller one and it probably would have fit. I have a little bit of space for some lipstick and um, some colors. So I'll try and figure out that. And I'm probably gonna be using this for my electronics. So I'm gonna see if my speaker and everything can fit in here. Well, I forced it in there and made it work. So this is my electronics. Other than my portable charger, which I'll probably be needing. My makeup stuff. And I also, like I said, I have my um, Joa Selfie Ready Boo Setting Powder that I'm gonna have to just put in here. And I have my Ulta Wannabe Active Makeup Setting Spray. And it also has SPF 50 in here, if you could see that. And that's perfect so I won't have to put a bunch of sunscreen on my face so I can have my makeup on and still spray this on my face if I want to. And I'm going to have my phone which is charging right now. My phone charger. Yeah. So I want to also put my fur in there because I just want to be fancy so I'll probably bring my fur too. Um, but I also wanted to review this Venture Pal backpack to see if it's all the hype. This is waterproof and it also is very um, compact when it's folded up and it gets pretty big. So this will be my carry-on. 
so I have so much maintenance to do today. I just got my nail done, but I also have to do my eyebrows, my mustache, shave. I also have to dye my hair, and I'm gonna do my self-care thing, do maybe a self-care mask, and maybe, you know, a, a face treatment on myself. Um, but yeah, also uh, tomorrow I will show you guys my airport outfit. But I will not be wearing regular sunglasses or contacts because I like to rest my eyes before I have to go um, and step out. So I'll be wearing these prescribed sunglasses, which is from iBuyDirect, and they are prescribed. And it's at a really low price, you guys. Um, these glasses and these glasses I got from iBuyDirect. And all you have to do is have your eye prescription. You can go and look at different types of glasses that you want, types of different shades that you want. You can also try them on virtually by taking a picture of yourself to see how they look on your face. These two were both under $50 together, so that should tell you. And I'm sure they have designer ones on there now because it's been a minute since I have actually ordered from them. But I'm going to get back on it, you guys, because I Buy Direct is amazing. I really do love the prices and the quality of the glasses that you do get. <clears throat> so, what I'm going to do right now is go ahead and put this stuff all together because I also have jewelry too. I'll show you a little snippet of the jewelry that I'm going to be using. I have to also find my jewelry case because I do have a traveling jewelry case. Wherever it is, I'm going to try and find it. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm going to try and get everything situated so I can figure out how this backpack is and let you guys know. So I will be using this, this next portion and I reroute on this backpack and also um, you guys already know everything that I have so I'm going to show you my jewelry and then the next video will be a, view, a review on this backpack and me packing this backpack with my carry on stuff. So let me show you my jewelry. This is going to be the jewelry that I'm going to be using. These little trios from Shein except for these I got these from Target. I have this little chain link um, necklace that I got from a jewelry shop. I have these nice little Shein statement earrings. I also have a gold bracelet, a couple of a couple of costume jewelry rings, and I got this. It's called Bloss Cat set from um i believe amazon and it came with this beautiful pearl necklace and it has like a little butterfly and it came with these little earrings and these are really cute and then i have a um an avon set that my kids got me with a sand dollar and it came with a little bracelet so of course i had to bring that too and that's my jewelry yeah, so that's going to conclude my um, travel packing video. If you want to see me review this and pack this, then go ahead and go in the next video, which is going to probably be uploaded after this video. But in saying that, thank you so much for watching my video. Please, uh, Ricky, uh, Ricky, uh, don't forget to what? Smash that like button. And also, I need some divas on my squad. So if, if you over there watching my video and you ain't subscribed, Rude, what are you doing? You watched this whole video and I know it was one of my longer ones. So evidently you might like this. So go ahead, subscribe, join my diva squad. And also I hope wherever you are, day or night, you're safe, you're loving on somebody, you have your health and blessings. Bye.